Oh, there you are, YouTube. So we started a new show today, The Queen's Gambit. And I guess I'll just have to start off by saying we really like it. But we were sort of holding, sort of holding off on it because neither one of us play chess. I have always loved Searching for Bobby Fischer. That movie, grew up with that movie. It was always on some movie channel while I was growing up. Can't remember if it was HBO or Cinemax or what, but I was always watching that. And I've just never, oh, sirens going off. Probably too quiet for you to hear, but a lot of sirens going off. Um, but yeah, I, I, I've i always enjoyed that movie, but I never played the game of chess. I think when I was in college, somebody sat down with me for a very short period of time, sort of showing me all the pieces and what each piece can do. I don't even think it went as far as to us playing a game or anything like that. I the only thing I remember is that there's a piece that moves in like an L shape and I don't remember how many squares it is. It's like maybe one, two, three, and then over one. Maybe, I don't know. It, like this, this was back when I was in college. So I was like a freshman or sophomore during this. And that's my chess experience. Um, I think my brother knows how to play though. Uh, but yeah, I never, never learned. I, Chess to me is something that I don't want to put the time into. I wish some fairy would just tap me on the head with a wand and be like, you know how to play chess. I just don't want to put the time into it, I guess. I don't know. I'm, I've never really been into board games anyway. I don't know if that's considered a board game, so apologies if that's offensive. But, you know, just in card games, that's never been my thing either. I've just always been a show and movie watcher. Never been much of an athlete. I guess I did fence in high school. I played soccer from, uh, man, when did I start soccer? First grade, probably, to, was it, I mean, did it go to my senior year, maybe, of high school, I think? Because um, we... I had to play in leagues because my high school is pretty small, so we didn't have like a team. So we had like these county leagues that we would play in. Um, but yeah, I think maybe first grade to, I'm pretty sure I played all the way up to my senior year. So yeah, just soccer, fencing, and you know, even video games. I really wasn't that into video games. I had a Sega Genesis. That was it. That's as far as I went, you know, playing Mortal Kombat and, you know, Sonic. That was about it. Sonic 1. I don't even think I went beyond that one. Yeah, I just, I had the Sonics, only the first Sonic where he's by himself. I never, I never got to know Tails. I never got to know Knuckles. I don't know all those other people. I'm a movie and TV guy. That's what I watch. So, searching for Bobby Fischer, big fan of that show. Or, I, I called it a show. Sorry, I think that's the second time I did that too. I'm a big fan of that movie. <laughs> I'm, I have a show on the mind because we're watching Queen's Gambit. So, yeah, my wife and I were like, eh, are we going to be into this? We may not be. And plus, everybody's talking about it. When everybody's talking about it, it's like, ugh. I mean, is it really that good? You know, you start questioning it because everybody seems to like it. And everybody seemed to like Queen's Gambit. So, you know, you sort of hold off for a while. You know, don't want to hit it when it's when it's so hot. And like everybody, I think is on to a new show right now, Brighterton, Britter, Britain, Brit, Brit. Uh, what 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 am I trying to say here? Bridgerton. That's it. I feel like everybody's talking about Bridgerton right now. But anyway, so today we we're like, okay. Let's, what are we going to do? I didn't have to do any work today, so let's watch a movie maybe, watch a show of some sort, and then we put on, like, we put the cursor or whatever on Netflix, on Queen's Gambit, and then watch the trailer. And that little, you know, that quick little, it's not a trailer, it's more like this, a scene, they'll give you like a clip, and we watch that, and we were both like, oh. Okay, actually, that looks pretty good. I, I want to see, I want to see this person beat all those people that these two twins here are trying to say she can't beat. So, if you know what clip I'm talking about, you you know what that what I was just referencing there. 
So that got us hyped to watch it. We watched the first episode, very good. And then, and, and the, the first one really gives you a lot of backstory too on this main character. And then the second one, you know, grows up, new actor uh, playing her. And um, I don't know, do I want to give stuff away? She's uh, an orphan. And then, um, you know, her, her parents die in a car wreck, or her mother at least. I think both of them, maybe it's just her mother. I think it was just her mother. And goes to an orphanage and, um, you know, spends the, a lot of her years there. And then when she's around 13, 14, gets adopted. And that's sort of what the second episode is about, is uh, her new parents, you know, her school, going to school and then start beginning to enter uh, these chess tournaments. So yeah, that, that's where we left off. We watched the, the first episode and the second episode, and we're really digging it, and performances are fantastic. It's filmed very well. It feels like a very substantial, well-made show, you know? I, I like the textures, I like the cinematography. There are some special effects in this that are great. You probably wouldn't think there's special effects in this show, but there are, and I think they are beautiful. Um, they're they're minimal, but they're they're, they're pretty great. Um, but yeah, I we're on board. We are here to watch it. We love that first episode with the younger actress playing the main character, and love the second episode. And I'm wondering if we're going to see. Uh, maybe flip back to the younger actress because she was she was really good, you know I'm be kind of ashamed to not see uh, Her again, so I, I kind of hope we maybe flip back and forth in timelines because um, Yeah, that that first episode was great and you know, I'd like to see more of that actress um, In while in the orphanage there was a lot of great discussion happening there with her the friends that she made the friend that she made No, I should say friends um, so it would be, I think, a good, a good episode to, to go back, you know, to that time period, I think. But anyway, I'm really excited to get into this show. Uh, I think there's only one season, right? Yeah, that's, as, I think, pretty sure as far as it goes. Don't know how many episodes are in this show, but, uh, or sorry, this season, but we got the first two done and we are excited to move on to the third, but it's pretty late, so we're gonna go to bed, so perhaps I'll see you tomorrow for more Pure Hangout.